Two years ago, the people of Buhari community in Unisari local government woke up to the sound of a military airstrike. The incident claimed the lives of eight people and left many injured. When the attack happened, those wounded had to travel 50 kilometers on a road to a health facility for treatment at Gaidam Hospital. But sadly, some of the survivors are yet to fully recover from the impact that came with the airstrike. The victims, who are not pleased with the military for allegedly neglecting the community since the incident happened, are demanding for compensation. Mustafa Abubakar lost his wife and six children. He still remembers the fateful day, a day he says he will never forget. <laughs> It was on Friday. I was at the market. Suddenly, we had a loud sound. I learned that it was Boko Haram shooting, so we ran for safety to avoid being sighted. I called a relative who lives close to my house. She broke the news that my wife and children were dead. The government should come and see what they did. That's why we kept this. And since the attack happened, nobody came to check us. Even those who are wounded need help. I'm so much traumatized even now because I lost my brothers and sisters. Five of them were inside the house when the shells killed them. According to the residents, the military mistook their community for a Boko Haram hideout, adding that since the bombardment which the military admitted to have carried out and pledged to investigate, the community is yet to get answers and interventions. In the meantime, 